I've collected a lot of stuff over the years, consoles, games, memorabilia, figurines, and I was looking through my photos the other day and I was wondering, what is something I regret not getting? Or what's something I should have sold and made a killing on that I missed out on? The photo in question was from 2018. And this photo made me ask this question because I was holding a new 3DS Excel, the SNES version that came with Mario Kart. If you know anything about 3DSs, these are kind of hard to come by, or at least they're pretty expensive. My friend told me that he personally has seen one for as much as $700. We are in the middle of our buy nothing year for games right now, my wife and I, so I really hope this doesn't come across my desk anytime soon. But that being said, I thought about this because the MSRP on that was $179, and the markup at this shop was $200. And my wife and I were trying to be financially responsible and we didn't buy it. We already had a sizable collection at the time. If I look now, I think I might have somewhere in the realm of about 12 3DSs or 2DSs if I have enough to spare. But that being said, I don't think I'm gonna come across this item A, probably ever again, or B, at that price, right? So what's something you regret not buying that you really wish you had? On the flip side of that, what's something you should have sold that you didn't? So back in March of 2020, right when lockdown was starting, I posted a photograph of my copy of Paper Mario Thousand Year Door, and someone messaged me and said that they wanted to buy it. If you remember, back then prices were skyrocketing, especially for GameCube. This person offered me $150 flat out, and I didn't go for it. Now you could say it could have been a scam, but assuming positive intent, I missed out on making a killing. I bought that probably a few years before for somewhere around $50, and I think I've only played it the one time. The remake is coming out soon, so it's not like I couldn't replay it in some capacity again, so I really wish I had sold it. This was just after I promised I wouldn't monetize my Instagram, so of course I wasn't going to go back my word. I told this person I wasn't really looking to sell it, and I still have it to this day. It's in pretty great condition, almost no scratches on it, and I could pop it in my GameCube right now if I wanted. I don't have an emotional attachment to this game though, so I probably should have sold it when I had the chance. Like I said, I bought it for like 50 bucks, and I could have sold it for 150 That's life, I guess. Let me know in the comments below what your biggest regret when it comes to collecting is. Is there something you wish you hadn't sold? Is there something that someone offered to sell you at a great price and you let it slip by? Let me know down below. Who knows, maybe someone will have that for sale at a great price. Share your thoughts and feelings in the comments below and hope you're doing well. Hope you're safe, healthy, happy, and we'll see you next time.